Hi there, in this video we're going to take a look at candlestick chart construction. So this is going to be a very quick video because this is a very simple uh, concept to grasp. So here we have the candles coloured red and green. Red for down bars and green for up bars. So by down bar we just simply mean that the low, sorry, the close occurred below the open. Okay, so here we have the open at this level here. Uh, we have the close at this level here. This is the low for the day down here. This small wick is the low for the day. And this longer wick at the top is the high for the day. So it's got all the same information that a traditional bar chart has, but it's just a little bit easier to see where, where all the action took place rather than with, a, with a, uh, the standard bar chart. It's a little bit uh, less easy on the eye. So this is... Um, uh, a way to see that. There is a variation of this which incorporates volume, obviously not for Forex, uh, and the more voluminous the bar, the wider it will be. I'm not a big fan of those. I find them a distraction and not terribly useful. Uh, but anyway, so that is the uh, down bar, and now I'm going to pause for a second and we'll show you the up bar. Okay, so here we have an example of uh, an up bar. Oops, sorry, I put this in the wrong spot. So it should be there. Oh, there we go. Okay, so here's the up bar. <clears throat> we have the low at the bottom, uh, of course. The high still at the top. So that's exactly the same as this uh, down bar here. But of course, the close and open are reversed. The close here is at the top. Well, not the top of the bar, but the top of this... Uh, solid candle and the open is at the bottom because it was an up day so we've had uh, the price action move upward in direction and hence we've got to close higher than the open so that is the construction of the candlestick chart very very simple not going to get into candlestick patterns in this video but we will address those in a later uh, video